Hi friends, it's Mrs. Martin here. Hope everybody's doing well. Um, today's math activity is going to be um, a little bit more simple, but just kind of a spot check to see how your student is doing. Um, today we're gonna be matching quantities to a numeral. So a quantity is the number of objects associated with a number. So if you count four objects, you're gonna look for the number four. Um, so we're gonna match the quantity to, um, to the number. Okay, let's get started. Um, all right, students. Hi, it's Miss Martin here. Hope you guys are doing well. I miss you so much. Um, I've been thinking about you guys, and I thought it would be kind of fun to count some animals today. I don't know about you, but the zoo is closed, and I've been thinking, what are the animals doing? So I thought it would be fun to count the animals. Today, when we count, we are going to count to find out how many we have, then we are going to match the quantity or the number of animals to a number. Let me say that again. We are going to count to find out how many we have. Then together, we are going to find the right number. We are going to match the quantity to the right number. Let me show you how we do it. All right, so the question here is, how many monkeys do you see? Hmm. I know I can touch and count to find out. Touch and count with me. One. Good job, we see one monkey. Now the hard part. Can you guys help me find number one in the numbers down below? Hmm, look, look, look. You can put your goggles on to really help you focus. Hmm. There it is, that's the number one. We counted one monkey, so we're going to pick the number one. Let's do it together. Click with me. We did it. Let's try another one. How many snakes do you see? Remember, you can touch and count to find out. Touch and count with me. One, two. How many snakes did we count? Two, you got it. Now we need to find the number two down below. Hmm, that's not number two. Hmm, nope, that's number four. There's number two, you found it. Great job, let's click. We did it. Ooh, how many dolphins do you see? Touch and count to find out. We can do it together. One, two, three. How many did we count? Three, you got it. We counted three dolphins. Do you remember what the number three looks like? You can touch the number three if you see it. You did it. This is number three. Great job, around the tree, around the tree, three, three, three. Good job. How many parrots do you see? Oh, I love parrots and how they tweet, tweet, tweet. All right, let's count to find out how many parrots we see. Let's do it together. One, two, three, four. We counted four parrots. Can you guys find the number four in the numbers below? You got it. That's the number four. Everybody say four. Good job. Now everybody hold up four fingers. Good job, you got it. You've got your four fingers. We counted four parrots, so four fingers go with the parrots, and that goes with the number four. Let's try another one. How many elephants do you see? Let's count to find out. One, two, three, four, Five. Good job counting with me. Now, hmm, can anybody find the number five? Hmm. 
You got it. Touch the number five if you see it. You're right. This is the number five. We counted five elephants, so we find the number five. Good job. Ooh, let's try a couple more. How many penguins do you see? Hmm, we can count to find out. And remember, when we count and we come to the end, we go down and back and start again. Here we go, let's count together. One, two, three, down and back, four, five, six. How many penguins did you count? Six, that's right. You counted six penguins. Now, can you find the number six below? Hmm. I'm looking and thinking. I remember that six has a big belly. Can you find a number that looks like it has a big belly? That's the number six. Touch number six if you found it. Good job. Here is number six. We counted six penguins, so we click the number six. Okay, here we go. Ooh, what animal is this? That's right, it's a lion. Can everybody roar like a lion? Everybody say roar. Whoa, you guys are some scary lions. All right, let's count to see how many there are. Get your pointer fingers out, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. How many lions did you count? Seven lions, great job. We counted seven lions. So what number are we looking for? That's right, we're looking for the number seven. Hmm. If you find it, you can touch it. I found it. Did you guys find it? Okay, let's press it together. We did it. We found number seven. Okay, now, oh, I love this animal, the pink flamingo. They have long legs. How many flamingos do you see? Touch and count and see if you can find out. We can do it together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice job, we counted how many? Eight flamingos. The last number we said was eight, which means we counted eight flamingos. So now we need to find the number eight. Hmm, I think I remember the number eight looks like a snowman. Can you find the number eight that looks like a snowman? Touch it if you found it. You got it, that's number eight. Everybody say eight. Good job. Two more friends, here we go. How many walruses do you see? Ooh, you can make some walrus teeth. These are my walrus tusks. We can count the walruses. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. How many walruses did we count? Nine, you got it. We counted nine walruses. Now we need to find the number nine. Hmm, I remember that number nine has a big noggin. That means a big head. Can you find a number that looks like it has a big head? Look, look, look. Think, think, think. If you found the number, you can touch it. You guys ready? Here's number nine with a big noggin. We counted nine walruses, which means we pick the number nine. Great job. All right, friends, last one. Ooh, 
How many alligators do you see? Ooh, those have a long tail. Be careful not to mess with an alligator. Okay, you ready to count them? They're just pretend, we can touch and count. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. I like how when you guys got to the end here, you went down and back and counted again. We counted ten alligators. Everybody say ten alligators. Good job. Hold up your ten fingers. You got it. We counted 10 alligators, so now we need to find the number 10. The number 10 is a big number. It has a one and a zero. Can you find the number that is a one and a zero? If you found it, you can point to it. Good job. You found the number 10. We counted 10 alligators, so we touch the number 10. We did it! Nice job, friends. I'm so proud of you. You guys worked so hard on counting the quantities or the number of objects and then mat matching them to the right number. When you count, you can count to find out how many you have. Then you can match that number to the number on the screen. Have a great day, you guys.